Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. In this video I'm going to be going over how to fix your HP DeskJet printer if it's constantly only printing blank pages. Um, this is a bit of an issue that um, a lot of people come across. Um, I find that this issue happens to most people uh, if you haven't used your printer in a long time um, or if it's just coming across a software issue. So there's actually going to be a few solutions in this video and I'm going to start with the most simple ones that you should try and then eventually um, they're going to get a bit more complex and they involve water and cleaning your ink cartridges. So let's get started with the first and most simple solution. So I've turned the printer around here and the first and most simple solution is always to turn it on and off again. But when I say turn it on and off again, I mean to actually pull out the back cable and make sure that the printer is fully dead. In doing this, um, you will essentially allow it to clear any software faults that might be occurring, um, and this should allow the printer to kind of essentially reset itself. I would say give it two to five minutes when it's unplugged, and then um, plug it back in. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. So it's been a few minutes, and um, the printer is now back on. But let's say you're still facing the issue, it's still printing blank pages. Well, probably what we should have had a look at first is quite important and it is to actually check if the printer has ink. Um, so quite simply, we're gonna open the uh, HP Smart App and we're gonna have a look. If your printer is connected to Wi-Fi, it will show up here on the right, um, you know, whether it has ink in it or not. You can check your printer status, but you can also check directly on the device itself. Sorry, I've got a bit of a shadow here, uh, but you can see over there, my, my two ink cartridges are actually completely full to the brim. Um, so I know that that's fine. Um, and then it wasn't showing earlier, but now you can see on the app my estimated supply levels. So it's pretty, it's pretty full up. Um, so yeah, so what's next? Well, maybe we should have a look at the actual ink cartridges themselves. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna pull, uh, you're gonna open the paper tray a bit more and you're gonna pull down the ink cartridge tray. Here it is. Now um, on the left you have your um, multicolored one um, or your tricolor as they call it. On the right you have your um, black and white. Now if I pull one of these out, I'm gonna push down and then up. Um, teach you a little bit about this first. So um, this is the ink cartridge and then over here is the actual printer head itself. So this is where the ink comes out. And the chances are, if your printer isn't printing any pages with any color or anything, the chances are there's probably an issue with the ink head here. Um, so we can do a few things to actually um, test if they're working. So with your ink cartridge here, one of the first things we can actually do is just carefully um, dab it on a piece of paper. And as you can see, it should leave behind some ink. You can see, you can press it a little bit hard if you want. You can see that it's leaving some uh, slight ink stains, which is actually a good sign. Um, however, your printer may not be doing that and, and that is not ideal. So if it's not doing that, what it could mean is that you haven't used your printer for a while and um, the actual print head over here is um, has clogged up or is uh, slightly dry. So what we'll do is we'll move on to our next solution, which involves getting some tissues and some warm water. So let me show you that now. Okay, so as you can see, I have my um, ink cartridge here, got a little bit of tissue and I have some warm water. It needs to be warm water, that's very important. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna dip just a tip in here and um, always just a tip. And I'm just gonna give it a, a, a careful wipe down. Um, and you can see some ink is coming off here. Um, I'll be honest, this one is working, so it makes sense as to why there's some ink coming off. But um, I'm gonna give that a little wipe down. And, um, and then I'm going to just dab it on the tissue to dry it out. And you can see that um, my three colors, my tri-colors of ink are, are coming out. And that's ideal, that's what I'm looking for. However, this isn't always the case for some people. So, if you've given it a wipe down and there's still nothing coming out, the next thing you can do, 
and don't be afraid to do this, is actually to leave this in some water for a little bit. Now, what I have here is I have just like a, a little Tupperware um, with about just under a centimeter of water. And it's actually fine if you get this area here um, slightly wet, that's okay. Uh, you just don't wanna get uh, above this line wet. Um, and what we're gonna do here is we're gonna attempt to, um, essentially, if there's any dry ink inside, we're gonna attempt to um, get it out and, and, and get it a bit more moist so that the ink can start flowing through. So as you can see, I'm just letting this sit inside there. And I recommend letting this sit inside there for um, five minutes. And then, um, yeah, so I'm going to leave this for five minutes and then we'll be back and we'll give it a go. Okay, so it's been about five minutes. Let's pull this out. And you can see uh, there's a bit of ink dripping out, which is always a good sign. Um, and what we'll do is we'll just begin to uh, dry this out. We can dab it down. I'm actually going to get my tissue and... Um, See if I can dry it a little bit better. And yeah, so that should fix um, a lot of the issues if you have a dried um, ink print head. Now, um, one of the things I do want to mention is if after five minutes it uh, still hasn't, um, it's still not letting out any ink when you're dabbing it like this, what I would then recommend you do is actually leave it in the water, remember only just this bottom section, for up to two hours. Um, by leaving it in there for up to two hours, you're essentially ensuring that any dry ink in there um, becomes moisturized and can be cleared out. So, um, so yeah, so that's that. Now, I guess, now that it's fully dried off, let me just make sure it's dry properly before I put it back in. So I've got my dry um, ink cartridge and I have my printer. And I should be able to put this straight back in there. Remember to be a little bit careful. I like to put my finger up here for some leverage. Clip it back in and uh, shut that. It will replace itself back in. And there you, get, there you have it. So those are my recommended solutions to solving um, any issues that you might come across with your HP DeskJet printer printing blank pages. It's a bit of an annoying problem. And I'll be honest with you, when I was researching this, I didn't expect to um, have to put the ink cartridge in water, but you know, it makes sense and it works. So thank you very much for watching. Uh, please check my channel if you need any other advice related to DeskJet printers and any other ones you may have. And thank you very much, have a nice day, goodbye.